Well, hey folks, I wanted to show you a quick hack, as we're calling it, um, to keep the screw tip from the Clanic Plus 4 base pad from gouging the corresponding surface in the magwell. If you look really close, and we'll give you a close-up later, there's already a little tiny dent showing up in the top of the bulge around the screw head. That's from the top of the screw when it comes up into the magwell. It actually wants to hit right there, which is kind of... By the time you do it three or four times, it'll create a little, a little dent right there, and then and the dent will stop getting any bigger, and you, but you'll have a little dent in the finish, and that's annoying. So if you want to prevent the, getting a little dent in the finish, here's the hack. What you're going to do is you're going to take a paint pen or something, any other piece of, um, uh, what am I trying to say, fingernail polish, for example, would look really good. And you tighten down the screw to where it's all the way tight on your magazine, like this. You take your paint pen, and then you mark the back end, the exposed bit of the screw. What that does is indicate which, which part of the screw is the back of the screw. Then you take, it, take this off, and take it all the way out of the system. And take it over to a bench grinder. And you're going to grind a little bevel right here, taking off a couple of the threads, um, so that you can create a screw that looks more like this one, which I've already done in advance. So you see there's got a little shiny spot right here. That shiny spot, if I'm successful in remounting it on my, on my base pad here, will line up with my paint splotch, and therefore line up with the back of the magwell. Then I can take my gun, drop the factory magwell, fake toy base pad, put in a plus four base pad, no impact, no little scratch, right? Nice, tidy, clean. So that's that.